Samsung Electronics is taking its mobile chief, J.K. Shin, and another co-chief executive officer off day-to-day -day operations as the technology giant looks to new leadership in attempts to revive its once-booming smartphone business. Well, the group's annual year-end reshuffle uh, did not come with too many surprises this time, as our Kim min -ji reports. There were no major changes this time around, but it's clear Samsung Group's latest shakeup took into account its flagging mobile division. Ko Dong Jin, who was in charge of mobile research and development, was promoted to head Samsung Electronics' mobile communications business. He played a key role in the development of the flagship Galaxy model handsets, and his hardware and software experience is expected to strengthen the company's smartphone business, which has seen its profit drop amid increased competition from foreign rivals. Samsung also announced a personal reshuffle for other affiliates, appointing 15 executives to new posts. Samsung says the promotions were given to people who spearheaded care developments, as well as those who will foster growth and bring about changes to the company. As for the owner family, Lee Seo Hyun, the youngest daughter of Samsung chairman Lee Gun Hee, was appointed president of Samsung CNT's fashion division. The list did not include heir apparent Lee Jae Yong, who's been acting as the head of the group after his father was hospitalized after suffering a heart attack in May of last year. The top executives at Samsung's corporate strategy office stayed in place. This could indicate that the group's succession plan is not complete. But once that's done, there will probably be a major reshuffle that may include his promotion. Industry watchers say for now, it seems a reshuffle led by Lee Jae-yong was focused on stabilizing the company amid his father's prolonged vacancy. Samsung is expected to announce a personal reshuffle for non-executive employees next week. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.